Hello everyone, so before I continue, a massive thank you to the legend, the saint, the master, what? <laughs> that is Animate, you guys know Animate, he's, like I've just said, he's a saint in this community, he's the one who posted about this on Twitter, he DM'd me with a screenshot that I'll get to in a second, this is real. Okay, so, yeah, this is, this is awesome, so, <laughs> Okay, so before I continue any further, I do need to say that this has been translated from Japanese to English using the, was it the Google Chrome built-in translate thing or whatever it is. So the English is broken. You can see right here, it says, um, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vedit. Um, that's uh, yeah, obviously talking about Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Vegeta. So as I'm reading, I will uh, try and you know correct it as I'm talking about it. So I'll just keep that in mind. Um, yes, yeah, so this is cool. Okay, so. This is from the official. This isn't. This is not a fan site. It's not two chan. This is the official Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 website that Namco Bandai have made. It is official. Again, need to make sure that you guys know that. I'll put a link in the description. Okay, so this here, all this stuff was posted today. Uh, this like this stuff was like posted. Well, and this picture as well, I guess. Um, this is from yesterday. This is like the um, skills that were birthed. Uh, birthed. Well. Buffed, nerfed. Yeah, guys, I'm really tired. Like I've been recording all day. Uh, these are like the skills have been nerfed, buffed, um, just changed, whatever. So that's from yesterday. But keep in mind, like as I'm recording this, I believe it's like what 6 a.m. Um, Japan time, I think. So it's like the 30th of June there. So this is what you guys are here for. Okay, so we will complete the season pass with this four DLC, DLC pack four, but. Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 will be planning a new expansion so users can further enjoy various events as well as future events. I will. <laughs> Hashtag I will. Oh man. Okay, so this basically confirms it now. I don't know why they didn't just say a second season pass. Well, actually, okay, saying it out loud, I think I do now because season pass is a bit of a dirty word in, this, in like gaming, I guess. Because it's like, it's like DLC, like that whole meme, I guess. So expansion, yeah, let's be fair. Yeah, let's be fair, lads. It means a second season pass or yeah, more DLC. Like I think it will be a second season pass with you know, we might have talking here, like we might have speculated, but I do think they'll put at least three DLC packs in. Maybe four, maybe five, I don't know, but I do think there'll be um, at least three just for what I can see. It just feels like three is like a good number for like a season pass, maybe. But yeah, this is all we know. Um, I mean, it would make sense for them to do this, given that photos is coming out in like, what, six, seven months? Eight, nine months? Like, somewhere like that, in early 2018. Um, and keep in mind, Dimps are working on Xenoverse, well, the Xenoverse franchise, series, whatever, and Arc System Works are working on um, photos. So, if they put more content into Xenoverse 2, it's not going to affect the development of uh, photos in any way, shape, form, or matter. It's just not. And right here, they said that uh, the Xenoverse series has sold over 7 million copies. Um, but the way that they uh, phrase this means that not Xenoverse 1 or 2, it's both of them combined. And given that Xenoverse 1 was for 5 consoles, the PS3, PS4, Xbox 360, and the, uh, well, uh, Xbox 360, Xbox One, and Steam, and Xenoverse 2 right now is on for Three consoles. I was gonna say four, but not yet. For three consoles: PS4, Xbox One, and Steam, and soon the Switch. It makes sense for them to continue doing this. And they did say, I, I do apologize. I forget the name of the producer. Um, Hir is it Hiranasan? I don't know who his name is. Um, I do apologize there. No disrespect. Um, but he did say that he wanted Xenoverse Two to <laughs> that he wanted Xenoverse Two to last for a very long time before they even started working on Xenoverse Three. And how long is Xenoverse 2 been out for now? Like what? Um, eight months? Just over eight months? That's not really that long, if we're being completely honest. And given that DLC 4 has just came out, it's not really that long, in my opinion. I mean, you know, eight months is nothing, so... Yeah, it would make sense for them to put, uh, well, to add more DLC. Now, here's the question, lads. What could it be? Well... Okay, so I had an e email earlier today from the um, Namco Bandai email list, like, and it said DLC. Okay, if I if I can find it up on email, um, a screenshot on the screen of the email, they said that the fourth and final DLC pack has been released. But this obviously is otherwise, yeah, say it's otherwise. And the reason why, why I mentioned that is because in the recent DLC pack for live stream with uh, Ramstar, after I'll send you attending with um, Demetrius, the host from Namco Bandai, like they did it. It's like watching it back. It like it's like he didn't know. 
what to say about more DLC, but given that they did say something does kind of confirm that there will be more DLC, but given that he didn't say yes or no, I don't know if there's some sort of lack of communication from Namco Bandai Japan to the rest of the Namco Bandai um, regions, that, yeah, like um, Namco Bandai US, UK, um, US, whatever. Like, I don't know if there's some sort of, you know, like, uh, communication issues there, but they just couldn't give a straight answer. So, yeah, I mean, I just don't know if, um, you know, I just don't know what's going on there. But, I mean, they did say, well, they, they didn't say, I should make that clear right now, but it was, um, apparently in data mine that Zamasu's attacks, like, um, just normal Zamasu, not merge, just like normal Zamasu, his attacks would be available in DLC Pack 4 as a mentor mission, and there's, like, mentor... Um, master quotes that were apparently uh, like data mine, but of course they are not in DLC pack 4 so I wonder if this means there'll be another masters pack um, or you know maybe a pack for transformations for avatars I don't know but it could I mean we don't know if it's going to be Dragon Ball Super but it would make sense if it's more super stuff given that super is extremely hot right now both inside of and outside of the Dragon Ball gaming community well yeah the Dragon Ball community rather it's like, it's just massive, like, everyone's talking about it in Dragon Ball. So, I mean, if it was that, they could do, like, what? Um, well, firstly, if this is going to be released when the Switch is, uh, well, the Switch version comes out, like, like, a month after, that's, like, when? Um, the 7th of September, I think, in the, uh, well, in Japan, I think I'm not too sure. So, we don't know about the um, UK, uh, not UK, uh, well, UK, I suppose, UK, Europe, or the US release dates, yeah. But it's coming out in Japan on the... Uh, I believe it was the 7th of September 2017 on the Switch, sorry, I should have made that clear, on, coming out on the Switch. So I don't know if there's going to be some sort of expansion or uh, season pass for that, and then they'll put it for the other consoles as well. Um, yeah, so I do think it will be more super stuff, personally, and like, what could they put in that? Uh, Kale, Khalifa, of course, maybe the Dangerous Trio, you know, that's three characters right there, as well as, you know, like, um, like what? Um, like new outfits and attacks for the existing characters like maybe Ultimate Gohan where he has um, Super Saiyan 1 or 2 I think it was Super Saiyan 1 when he used it against um, one of those guys from the, in the um, exhibition match like he was Super Saiyan 1 then he went to oh no he didn't go to Ultimate that was fighting Piccolo so I do I, I'd like to see a preset of Gohan Ultimate Gohan where he has Super Saiyan 1 or 2 as his transformation then he can then turn Ultimate on top of that that would be pretty fun to see um, yeah, we'll have to wait and see. I mean, they could pull like two new stages in the Zeno exhibition match, and as well as the um, what is it? The I, I mean, what is it? Of course, like how can I forget this? The tournament of power stage. Like, of course, I would love to see that. If that was in, I don't think I'd use any of the stage. Uh, you could put Jairo in the grey, but well, maybe not him because we don't know that much about him yet. But you could put Topo in. Yeah, I mean, they could do more super stuff, and I do think they will, to be honest, because it is what's really hot right now. Hopefully this means Rage, Trunks, Merge, Zamasu, and even Demigraph and Zenobus 1 will be playable because them in the game, apparently, I think it was Jad and Tastic posted, I'm not too sure, or Zenki, I'm not too sure, posted on Twitter, but apparently Merge, Zamasu isn't complete, so hint, hint, I don't know. But yeah, guys, all I'll say is that this is more DLC, um, it'll probably mean more TP medals, so you might as well go and grind them now, I suppose, if you haven't already, you know, make sure you've got a ton of them because... This could mean, I think it's safe to say, at least three new packs. Uh, it could be four, it could be more. We could get a third expansion, but that's that's really uh, speculating. But given that, you know, Super is still hot and it's ongoing, I do think it will be Super content. It may be GT as well, you know, like um, the Dragons. Could be movies, you know, it could be like filling in um, characters that aren't in from like, you know, like second and third form Freezer. Uh, semi perfect cell, Buhan, Butengs, Buricolo. <laughs> you know, so yeah, this is going to be rather interesting. But again, like, I don't repeat myself, but I do honestly think it will be uh, super content because, I mean, it's it's Dragon Ball Super. Why wouldn't they capitalize on how hot it is right now? Like, especially with Khalifa. Like, people love Khalifa. Um, and especially if they're putting Khalifa, Super Saiyan 1, Super Saiyan 2, and Kale, and then her Super Saiyan Berserker form, or quote unquote, super, uh, legendary Super Saiyan, whatever you want to call it. So yeah, uh, really, really interesting stuff. Again, no release date yet. I think it'll be um, maybe revealed or like the first pack of this new expansion will be released on the, just after the Switch version comes out. I mean, I don't know. So thank you for watching, guys. I do hope you enjoyed it. And with that being said, I will see you next time.